Well, good afternoon. Welcome to ClemsonTigers.com. I'm Tim Beret, and here with head coach Larry Penley. And Larry, it's the championship time of the year, getting ready for the ACC uh, tournament. Tell us about uh, your team's mindset going into this year's event. Well, this is always a big week for us. You know, this is one of our goals, if not our biggest goal. So, uh, you know, we're looking for a lot of focus. Um, a great conference field again. You know, I think we have right now four top 20 teams. Uh, Georgia Tech is going to be the team to beat again. They've been anywhere from number three in the country, I think currently number eight in the country. Um, but we're gearing up and we're getting ready. You know, we got Corbin Mills back finally. And uh, I can already tell in the attitude of our teammates that he's already made a, made a difference and an impact just being back on campus. So we're really looking forward to getting him back and start preparing for the next two or three days to get ready and go up there and try to win a championship. Sometimes the players who have played in the Masters uh, before the ACC tournament have a little bit of trouble focusing. Really not the case with Corbin. He's had a solid year all around. But the guys who uh, have played in the Masters then have excelled for you in the ACC tournament. Chris Patton, Ben Martin, they've been your best players in the past in the ACC. I know you kind of expect the same thing from Corbin. Yeah, I think he's kind of relieved all that hoopla is over. You know, it was such a big buildup for Augusta. And then this past week at, at the Heritage down in Hilton Head, and I knew he put a lot of time and effort into it, um, deservedly so. He earned the right to be there in both tournaments. But I think he's really excited about getting back with his teammates and getting on with our postseason play and trying to help us win a championship. I don't think he'll have any problems getting refocused. Now you're going to be able to return to your lineup that had two firsts and a second. Uh, really 50-1 and one against the field, your first three tournaments this uh, spring. I know you're excited about that. Uh, Crawford Reeves has really had a terrific spring for you. Yeah, Crawford has been fantastic. Um, after being without him in the fall and then getting him back full bore in the spring and healthy now, I think 100% maybe for the first time this spring, yeah, we, we feel really good about things. And we've had other players step up. You know, Thomas Bradshaw has done a fantastic job all year. Um, McEwen Elmore. I think he missed Corbin the most. That's his roommate on the road, and, and I think he just really missed having Corbin out there. And you could tell it in his confidence a little bit. And then you got freshman Billy Kennerly, who has just done a fantastic, fantastic job. Um, very steady. Kind of reminds me a lot of David May, who won on this golf course. Uh, you know, and Billy's scores just count every week. Um, so we're, we're really expecting a lot of good things. Um, it's not going to be easy, but I expect us to play well. Bradshaw, in particular, one of the best short game players in the country. Yeah, we're. Uh, I looked at the stats really hard this weekend. It kind of surprised me how good our putting has been. Uh, I think we're leading the, the the country as a team in putts per round, and Thomas individually is leading the country in birdie conversions, um, which is pretty impressive. So I feel like if we can get there and hit a lot of greens, we should have a good chance. Tell us a little bit finally about the old North State course. What do you got? What areas of the game do you have to do well in to, to win a championship? You, you have to putt, um, and, and that golf course will be a putting contest. Um, it's somewhat forgiving off the tee. There's some some holes that are very demanding coming down the stretch. The par threes don't overwhelm you with a lot of length, um, and it'll be a birdie fest. Uh, the 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 greens don't seem to have a whole lot of contour. Shouldn't be very tricky. And they've had the same winter we have, where we expect that golf course to maybe be up to a month advanced as far as its spring growth. We expect it to be totally green, and we expect the greens to be absolutely perfect. So it should be very conducive to some excellent scores. So that's it for Larry uh, Pedley. A scouting report on the ACC tournament begins a Friday. The Tigers will play with Georgia Tech and NC State. Tournament runs Friday, Saturday, Sunday. I'll be there to provide some uh, Stories on the tournament, you can follow the progress of the scores on golfstat.com. For ClemsonTigers.com, I'm Tim Beret.